Hi, my name is Siri, and you're watching Disney Channel. Oh, oh. Hello, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I hope you're having a nice day. If you don't know who I am, I'm Siri, and I'm from Norway. This is going to be a how I pull myself together or like how I maintain myself and just what I do on those days when I just want to feel extra fresh and put together and just like ready for the day. So if you would like to see my tips and tricks on makeup, hair, hacks, things and things, then watch this video. So this is what my hair looks like at the moment. I haven't washed it for Two days, I think. I, I can't to stop touching my hair. My hair. I'm touching my hair, my hair all have the time. Yes, touch those ends, but I like to you know, touch it. Yes, touching the hair. So, yeah, mm, yeah I love it. Washing your hair like only like once or twice a week is really good for your hair. So that's actually a tip because I feel like hair is a really important part of you know the look. I'm actually so hungry, I need a chocolate. Today I'm gonna show you one of my newest and one of my like favorite techniques to make my hair look more healthy and just more... Mm. So I only use a straightener, this is from GHD and then just like a tangle teaser brush because I think it's better for your hair, I don't know. So this usually takes me about 10 to 15 minutes. What I do is just that I take a piece of hair and you can also like put the rest up. I just like hold my hair like this in the brush and then I take the straightener and I start to like bend the brush and the straightener. This part is really brassy today so I'm gonna stop talking and I'm just gonna do the rest of my hair. Okay so this is how it looks compared to my natural hair and you should by the way also use heat protection but I'm just too lazy to go to the store so I usually use some oil or something to compensate and if it's like a period where I do this a lot I will like of course buy heat protection. I probably look so focused while doing this but you gotta do what you gotta do. This is the finished result for the hair. I really, really like it. I feel like it just looks effortless, but it still looks like my hair is healthy. And I think the shape is just really cute. So, that'll keep my clean. And to finish the hair, I'm actually going to apply to baby pink hair clips, just to, you know, be a little extra. This is the finished look for the hair. The next thing I like to do to just feel more glam and more stylish and more fresh, especially during the week when I'm in school and stuff, is actually to wear jewelry. And I usually have like my go-to jewelry, so I've been wearing these earrings a lot lately. And then I have this ring from Louis. And then I have three go-to necklaces. This one is the first. It's like a upside down horn, I think. And it's from Mariah Black. The next one is like a white circle from Marc Jacobs with the logo inside. And the last one is like a chained choker from H&M, I think. So this is the jewelry I usually use when I just want to feel more stylish and more like elegant and put together. So now we can go over to more technical stuff like my glam bag and my skincare and stuff like that. Somehow I didn't manage to say what I wanted to say in that clip, but the shampoo I'm using is the Botanicals Fresh Care Safflower Rich Infusion by L'Oreal. I use the conditioner that follows with it and this one is actually empty now and it's like my third bottle I think. They also have like a hair mask but for some reason I don't think they have it in the Norwegian stores anymore. So then I tried this hair mask. It's called El Vital. El Vital. El Vital. El Vital. El Vital. El Vital. Oh my god that's so awkward to say. This. I'm honestly not the biggest fan of this one. I don't feel like it helps my hair that much, but everyone has different hair and maybe it will work for you. So if you have really dry hair and you want six precious flower oils in your hair, you should consider trying this one. 
So after the shower, I really like to put coconut oil in my hair as like a leave-in conditioner. And this one is organic and it's called Green Choice. I actually started buying this for food at first because it's really good in like banana pancakes and stuff like that. Then for my body, these are my current favorites because my skin is also super 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 sensitive this is what i use in my face and on my body it's called apple base cream so this is just like a all over cream and this is actually only a moisture restoring cream so i mean it works as a moisturizer but it's like really light so what i like to use also is a new product that i've just started using and it's from aderma and it's called emollient cream for face and body i'm not a dermatologist this is just what works for me so yeah and also i'm naturally really dry around my eyes so then i use this kiehl's creamy eye treatment with avocado i think it's really important to moisturize the lips as well and my skin is super 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 sensitive and i think i'm actually allergic to some like lip balms and stuff so this is what I've been using lately for my lips. It's just like honey and the coconut oil I showed you earlier. The next thing I'm going to talk about is my bag with all the things I use to freshen up. So I always have this with me, the moisturizer I showed you earlier. I can use it for my lips, I can use it on my body, I can use it on my face. I honestly love perfume so much. I love to use a lot of perfume. That's just the tea. And when someone else is smelling nice, I'm just like, oh my god. And honestly, one of the best compliments you can give me is that I smell good. And I just love to have my go-to scent. So this is my current favorite. It's called... I'm not even gonna pronounce the name. This is the name and it's from Dolce & Gabbana. And it honestly... I don't know. It just smells like... You shouldn't really spray perfume on your jewelry directly. So what I usually do is just like hide it under my shirt and I just spray. Other things I like to have with me, especially if I'm wearing makeup and if I need to look fresh throughout the whole day, is my powder foundation and this is from Eden Mineral. And I also use a bronzer from the same brand. I like to have with me my Lancome Mascara and my Shoe Amora Lash Curler just to, you know, touch up the lashes. And I actually have really oily eyelids, so I like to have like a blending brush with me. Then just like a little detail brush to like touch up my under eyes and my chin if I have like a pimple or something and my lip gloss from Eden as well it's like the perfect pink color a couple of hair ties if I need to tie my hair up and a mini brush and this is quite big as you can see it's like the same size as my head so therefore I only carry this when I'm wearing like bigger handbags or if I'm like wearing makeup to school or something so as always my camera dies during the video but the next thing I was going to talk about is actually wearing a handbag and this video is not only about you know makeup hair skincare it's about what i do those days when i just want to feel a little extra you know a little polished a little mm, you know so i actually love to use handbags those days and you know when i wear a handbag i feel like i always like try to at least pretend i'm classy this one is way too big for the handbag so i only take like the most important things with me and that would be my perfume my bronzer because i feel like that's like the thing that goes away during the day cream obviously my hairbrush and i don't know like why my airpods aren't here like i usually have them with me and of course a charger for my phone or a power bank or something and of course a wallet and i also like to have gum with me just to feel fresher because dental hygiene is also really important in order for me to feel my best and i'm actually in the process of bleaching my teeth now at the dentist so i sleep with this thing in my mouth with like some 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 shoo thing in there and it's like wow and by the way i brush my teeth morning and evening and also during the day if i'm like doing something extra special or something like if i'm filming a video and i want my smile to be extra clean and fresh i always brush my teeth outfit and like fashion is also really important to me when i want to feel more put together uh so you know just like finding a cute outfit like jewelry as i mentioned a bag 
I love to have my shoes clean. Usually if I get them dirty, I just like clean them afterwards and like have a nice jacket. If I'm having a bad day or something, I usually like put makeup on or something because then it kind of makes me like suck it up and like do something productive with my day. This is only for like the days when I want to feel, you know, like <coughs> Because I think we all have those days when we're just like wearing a hoodie Oh my god, hoodie tumbler And I honestly love to just have like a bare face with no makeup It feels so nice and it's so good for your skin And that's actually it for this video Thank you so 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 much for watching I hope you liked it If you did, please give it a thumbs up or a like And subscribe And comment something down below if you want to, you know And I will see you in my next video, video.